<laughs> center stage. All right, this is uh, if you ever hear Robbo mention the, the going the stuff is sitting in Siberia. Well, that's this spot right here. This area right here. <laughs> It's a nice breeze here. Just get a chair and sit here. Yeah. Couple of uh, clamps there. Couple of even bigger ones up there. You got the yeah. Uh, you got the dunny. Even got to show the dunny man. Come on. Got these things up here. Some of those chairs from in uh, Mongolia. The green one. You're the only one I can see that can lift them. Teaching. All the way from Cleveland. Yeah. Bansaw. He's got a, a cup that has got a cupboard in there. It's full of like um, metho and all that type of stuff. You got uh, little odds and sods there. And I'm just gonna see if I can find the lock of that room. So, I just turned the lights on in here. Oh, I thought I did. Press the wrong bloody button, didn't I? Oh, yep, I did too. Oh, yeah, it happened there. Oh, no, the bloke that owned it. Because the music had that variable speed on it. You had variable speed on it. See if that one works. This is, this is the place you want to be in. Look. Draws. <laughs> there you go. One's got tools in it here. Inside. Inside this cupboard. Yeah. There we go. Uh, router bits and awesome bits and stuff. Uh, a couple of big buggers up there. Just keep going and going. Whoops, put my finger out of the way of the camera. Right, that's, that's one door. Oops, can't see in that one. Let's have a look. That's that's just it's tools. It's tools in that one there. You can't see it. There. We got uh, chucks, chucks, and chucks and chucks in there. Center steps and stuff down the bottom. And there you go. Look, we got another another door behind that one, and that's got the face plates and stuff on it. All up the back there. All right. And uh, and he's got these drill drill trucks in here. Another spot to put tools, but there's only uh, only one in there. And he got all his sandpaper, all his air tools, a couple of staples over there. Got uh, lots of corded drill, drill uh, corded tools in here. No, they're not drills, just basically everything. But some routers down there. Couple, couple of routers. <coughs> Got a nail gun down there. Couple of 
for the old school centers. Yeah, pretty cool in here. It's friggin' up, I'll give it that much though. We got when we step we come back out of there and there's that cupboard there that we just looked in with the tools and chucks and stuff. And then we got and then we got see it's that side and then here. And then this side. And this one has um hole saws and planers and um, glue sticks and stuff. A couple of battery powered drills. Just, just really well organised. And this, that's just me opening this cupboard here on this side of it. And then you got them down there. Hear the music in the background. Yeah, these, these, these drawers just keep going and going. Alright, we're gonna go and visit Henry now, alright? Thank you, This is the, the tail stock. Sorry, this is one of two tail stocks on here. There's the gantry for it. And that goes all the way down the length of the lathe. Um, he's also got um, these bits of wood down here with the hinges on them. They're all cupboards with all stuff in them. So. But uh, no matter how close or what kind of footage you get on a on a um, camera, it really never does any justice until you see this thing in person. Though. Got the all the bracing under there goes all the way along like that. I've got his uh, it's basically like flatbed syndrome along here. <laughs> See? All that flat space. And got his grinding jigs up there. Got an old GMC up there. This is the other tail stock. This one's a bit more chunkier than the last one though. Right, massive. This is the this is the most valued tool in the in the shop. This is so yeah. <laughs> most valued tool in the shop. That one. There's a, a bell. I honestly couldn't tell you how long that bell has been here, but it was actually up in that cupboard up there. I pulled them out. Alright, on with the the lathe. There's the uh, center for it there. Then you got um, got uh, gears on the back here as well. Because I do believe it's got 72 gears or something. Yeah, very cool. And this is looking from the other end. And uh, extension cords are kept there. There's another another room out there. It's more for um, uh, just open storage. Nice big fan there. Uh, dust extractor down there. Decent size. And we got his uh, got his scrapers here. And uh, you got this cupboard around here. You got um, it's got nothing in it now, but he did have it. Yeah. <laughs> you 
This one's got tools in it, but I can't get the bloody thing open. So. It's got tools and stuff in here, look. It's just full, all the way to the bottom with tools. This one's got face shields. Face shields and stuff. Welder down there. This is where uh, Robbo's music comes from, here. Got another bit of machinery out there, I'm not too sure what that's for. And we got storage up there too. And the red light that he used to turn on in his lives used to be just here, where this um, bench is. Uh, where it's got all his tools and stuff there. Um, we got got... Uh, this is the back of a um, Wodkin, this one. Show you the front in a second. Here's the front of it. This is a um, five tonner. This one actually had to have its own specific cement to cement it down. Yeah. So that's bolted into the ground one. Ten inches or something. Couple of pepper grinder. Oh, he was probably busy, buddy, Stop. listening. <laughs> Just uh, odds and sods on that shelf, really, if anything. And this is his office. It's looking back out of his shed there. A little fridge there, microwave. <laughs> The most uh, most important section here, the tea and coffee section. This is his office.